Okay, so good day everyone. We have there the last topic for your exercise set 2.3 that is for chapter 2. Ito. Ito, ito po yung last, ano natin, last topic sa, kasi yung 17 tsaka 19 naging 20 lang naman. Okay, so sagutan na natin. Let G, yung number 17, okay, number 17. Uh, number 17, let G be the successor function. So, successor function po, ganyan to put. Po yan, ganyan. Nandito yung N, pang F of N, which is N plus 1. Yun po. Successor function defined as G of N is equals to N plus 1. So, find G of negative 1,000, G of 0, and G of 99. So, madali lang po yan. Okay? Sasagutan na natin solution. Solution. What we are going to do is simply substitute the value of n to your formula. Okay? So, g of negative 1,000 is equal to ano yung n? Ay di negative 1,000. Negative 1,000 plus 1. So, ano pong sagot? Plus 1. So, negative 1,000 plus 1. So, ano pong sagot? So, positive pa rin po yan. Ang sagot. Okay? So, negative 1,000 minus 1. Ah. Ito lang ha. Ayos yung 10. So, negative 1,000 plus 1. Ang sagot natin ay negative 99. Sagot po natin ay negative 999. Ayan po sagot natin. <clears throat> Next. G of 0 naman. G 0. G of 0 is equals to of course yung n natin is 0. 0 plus 1 is equals to 1. Yung pong sagot natin. Next. Ang baba na lang natin. Next. G of 999. So, G of 999. Plus to, of course, ang N po natin ay 999. 999 plus 1. And, of course, ang sagot po natin is 1,000. Yun po yung <coughs> number 17. <coughs> number 19 naman po. <coughs> Bawang number 19. Okay, so dyan na lang number 19. Basahin natin. Define functions from, uh, functions f and g from r to r. Real number to real number by the following formulas. For all x element of r. Po. f of x is equals to 2x and g of x is equals to 2x cubed plus 2x over x squared plus 1 and po, x squared plus 1 does f equal to g explain yun po ang tanong does f equal to g so tignan po natin so, maglilet lang tayo. Mag-substitute po tayo ng value. Halimbawa, let let x equal to 1. Then, f of x f of uh, f of x is equals to 2 times 1 which is equals to 2. Yung isa naman, and <coughs> g of x g of x is equals to <coughs> ibig sabihin po niyan, 2x cubed. So, x, uh, ang x po natin ay 1 is meaning 1 times 1 times 1 kasi yung cube. So, ang sagot is 1 times 2 is 2 plus 2 times 1. So, 4 over 2. 
So, anong sagot? So, ang sagot po natin ay uh, 4 divided by kasi ang x squared ay 1 times 1 is 1. Sa denominator na tayo, tingnan natin denominator dito. So, 1 times 1 is 1 plus 1 is 2. So, ibig sabihin, 2. So, equals 2, 2. So, tama po. So, base dyan. Base dito, does f of g, does f of g, does f of g equal, or f is equals to g, equal po siya. So, yes po ang sagot natin. Another solution po. So, kung mapapansin po ninyo ito, pwede natin mapaktor. So, factor natin. Factor natin itong G, ha? yung numerator. Ito yung numerator. Magiging 2X times times ano natin ba? X squared squared po plus 1. Yun po siya. Kasi pinaktor natin. Tingnan mo. Pag itong 2x, <clears throat> pag itong 2x, minultiply sa x squared, magiging 2x cube. Ayan po. 2x cube. Tapos, 2x times 1, magiging 2x. Okay? And then, over, over, yung denominator po ay <coughs> hindi nagbago. X squared plus 1. Ayan po yung X squared plus 1. So, mapapansin nyo, <coughs> itong X squared plus 1 yung denominator. Tapos yung sa taas yung 2X times. Factor po siya. Factor po siya nung ito. Factor, to, uh, factor po siya ng 2X cubed plus 2X. Ito po ang factor niya. 2X times 2x squared plus 1. So meaning, ito pong dumina, uh, denominator, cancel na po natin siya. So ang mangyayari, pag sinimplify po natin, is equal siya sa 2x. Okay? <clears throat> so yun po ang sagot. <clears throat> okay? So yun po ang sagot. <clears throat> so thus, <clears throat> so the answer is, Answer is, answer natin is, yes. Yes, kama. F is equals to G. Okay? Since, since, kama. All, since all elements of X satisfies, uh, since, since, All x element element of R satisfies satisfies both f of x and g of x. Simple explanation. Further, lagi natin. Further, if we are going to simplify, simplify g of x, g of x. If we are going further, if we are going to simplify further more or further. If we are going to simplify g of x, we will arrive to two x, which is the f of x. Okay. Yeah, because don't sa ito yung explanation natin. Ito. Simplification of simplification of g of g of x. Okay? So, yan po. Simplification of g of x. 
Pag binigyan po kayo dito mga ganitong tanong, tignan niyo po, i-factor niyo po sa factoring po yan sa college algebra. Nandun na rin sa high school sa mga factoring. Tignan niyo maigi, i-factor niyo. Or by trial and error po itong isa. Ito po, by trial and error po itong ginawa natin. Let x equals to 1. So substitute natin. So nakita naman natin, equal. Siguro naman sa 2. O kung sa 2 naman. But then sabi nga, nung sinimplify natin, ito palang uh, uh, ito palang term na to ito palang fraction na to ng g of x ito fraction numerator over denominator ay equal lang din sa 2x so ayan na po yung solution okay so katulad po ng number number 20 yung number 20 po tricky I-expand nyo po kasi x minus 2 squared. Yung number 20 po ay x minus 2 squared. Yung isa, yung h, ano yan? Uh, h of x. H of x. I-expand nyo po yan. Is equals to x minus 1. X minus 1. X minus, uh, minus 2. Minus 2. <clears throat> X to y. X to y squared. So, ibig sabihin kung expand nyo po iyan. Expand nyo po iyan. Ay magiging. Magiging. I-square nyo po yung una. So, X. So, X square. I-square po ng una ha. Pag nag-expand po tayo, X square. So, X square. Tapos 2 times x times negative 2. So minus 4x po yan. Yan. Pag in-expand po natin. Minus 4x. Algebra yan. Tapos square natin yung panguli. So plus 4. Yun po yun. Okay. So yun po yung. <coughs> ito po yun siya. Then. Yung isa. Yung kx. Subukan natin yung kx. Yung kx po. K X is equals to multiply lang natin. So, X times X X times X X squared. So, X kasi dyan ha. X minus 1 times X plus 3 plus yung sa kabila plus 1. So, tingnan natin. Multiply natin ha. X minus 1 times o dito tayo. Sulat na natin. X minus 1 times X minus 3. Sarado. Nakamultiply po yan. <coughs> Idamay na natin ito. Plus 1. <coughs> so ganito po yan. So X times X. So X times X is X squared. X squared. X squared. Tapos X minus 3. O X times negative 3. So magiging negative 3X. So negative 3X. Tapos na yung si X. Kayo negative 1 naman. Negative 1 times X. So magiging negative X. Tapos negative 1 times negative 3. So positive 3 plus 1. So makikita natin. Kung isimplify po natin yan, you know, kung isimplify po natin yan is x x squared negative 3x minus x is negative 4x tapos 3 plus 1 to plus 4. So makikita nyo, itong dalawa, ayan siya, saka yun, pareho lang. Okay? So meaning number 20 is, yes, ang explanation parang ganito lang din po. Okay? So I hope you understand the discussion through this video and God bless us all. So tapos na po natin yung chapter 2. Sa mga estudyante ko, ilagay ko na lang dyan sa Google Classroom. Yung assignment nyo ay yung chapter 2 test, page 53 to 54. Yun ang magiging assignment nyo. So i-assign ko na lang yan sa Google Classroom. So bantayan nyo, magkakaroon tayo ng quiz na.
for the midterm siguro doon sa mga next week. Itong week na to, sunod ay next week. Itong week na to ay panoorin ulit ninyo to. Ito yung magiging topic natin. Advanced study lang po tayo. Tapos, dapat next, itong week din po, dapat meron na kayo ong chapter 3 at chapter 4 ng uh, libro natin. Okay? So, thank you and God bless us all. Okay? So, pwede nyo rin i-share itong video natin. Okay? So, ingat COVID po. Masakit na yung lalamuna natin. So, thank you and bye-bye for now. Okay? Okay? <clears throat>